This morning, we're learning some disturbing allegations about what some say went on inside a Forney Elementary School classroom. Yeah, there are accusations that fourth grade students assaulted a classmate after a teacher allegedly taped him to his desk. Our Nick Starling live in Forney to explain. So, Nick, what exactly happened? Well, what we know so far is that this allegedly happened last Wednesday here at Crosby Elementary School, where several students are accused of assaulting a 10 year old boy. Now, we spoke with that boy's mother, Charlotte Johnson, who tells us her son, Zai, has dwarfism and is a good kid and plays sports like football and gets along well with the other students and hasn't been a victim of bullying in the past. However, last Wednesday, she tells us several students are accused of assaulting Zai during an incident that started when his teacher left the classroom after allegedly using tape to tie the child to his desk. Johnson says she got a call from the school afterwards and was told the teacher did it because Zai wouldn't stay seated and has now been placed on administrative leave. And she said, well, the teacher taped Zai to his desk and some of the children in the classroom were hitting him over his head with their hand and their fist. And I said, roll back. You said taped, T-A-P-E-D? And she said, yes, taped. And then she began to repeat what I said, T-A-P-E-D. And I said, what would make her think that that was okay? Forney ISD didn't confirm that, but released this statement saying, quote, we are aware of the allegations and investigation is underway. There are two sides to every story, and we need to allow time for the investigation process to take place before commenting further. Now, Johnson says her son suffered headaches, but is okay right now. He did go to a different classroom the following day, but Johnson wants that teacher fired and criminal charges filed. The investigation is underway. Live in 40, Nick Starling, CBS News, Texas. Yeah, concerning for sure, and a story we'll stay on top of. Nick, thank you.